first French game. <laughs> it's so funny that that's going to be the first line they hear in this clip. Now, I thought I was your first friend. <laughs> All right, so our next story here, we're talking about, I didn't even know about this. Uh, we have a documentary coming about the man himself, Mr. Hideo Kojima, brought to you. Well, we found it. I'm sure there's other places that have it, but we found it on Video Games Chronicles. We have a trailer here that we are going to pull up. He is probably the most well-known game creator in the world. In the space of gaming, he's the master. It's kind of like stepping into Willy Wonka's chocolate factory with Willy Wonka. And if you have played Death Stranding, you will understand. Well, no one has seen anything like this. People have to produce it themselves. ではまあ、自分の会社なんで、これを yeah. He also, and I, I always forget about this, he also did Zone of Enders. Video gaming is an art, but the only person in charge of the orchestra is the orchestra. Ah, uh, I have to... The purpose of stories is to make meaning out of life. Game is it that I and have. that's why his work is so important. That's right. <laughs> It's the obligation of any artist to I push I, I, boundaries. Yeah. So, this, again, like, you know, it said in there, is a look into the mind of Kojima's creative process whenever he launched Kojima Productions. Um, so, coming soon, where can we watch it? I'm not sure. I don't know if this is going to like, can you imagine going to the theaters and watching this? <laughs> Dude, this would probably sell out faster than a Marvel movie right now. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Probably. A, a video on Naoki Yoshida. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Yoshi P. Is there a video on Naoki Yoshida? <clears throat> so. um, apparently there is, and, and Steve's going to link you on it. Okay, good. And then we'll share it out there. Okay, so Zone of Enders. Adventure yeah. named Snatcher and pol Police Knots. I think I remember seeing about this back in the day. Okay. Kojima started his career back in 1986 at Konami. Now, he was doing... He did primarily the Metal Gear games, but in the most more recent years of him being at Konami, we know about the poor treatment he received. And I'm curious as to whether or not they'll go into that or if he has an NDA revolt regarding his time at Konami. Um, now, I imagine he they would want to get that on there, although I don't know how they would get him to sign an NDA. Considering a lot of people kind of already know what happened. Oh. What? Kojima founded Productions in 2005 under the control of Konami. After splitting from Konami in 15, he reformed Kojima Productions as an independent studio backed by SIE. The studio's debut game was 2019's Death Stranding. It's a phenomenal game. Um... I know it got a lot of crap from people about it being just postman simulator or dad simulator, as Rob called it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we do have a Death Stranding 2 and a mysterious cloud project with Xbox, uh, which could be a horror title called Overdose. Now, what we all want to see is the Silent Hill reboot demo video that we got with Norman Reedus, although we did have Norman Reedus in Death Stranding. 
But we all know with Kojima's mind with horror games and because I'm pretty sure he did Silent Hill or he had a part to do with Silent Hill. Yeah, he did. He did a lot with Silent Hill, actually, yeah. if I remember right. Uh, Silent Hill is still one of those games that freaks people out. <laughs> Despite all... I enjoyed the movies, but I know a lot of people gave the Silent Hill movies a lot of crap. But, please, let us know what you think. Would you be interested in seeing Kojima? Uh, like Steve said, Naoki Yoshida, another big uh, Japanese developer who's currently heading a lot of projects over at Square Enix. But please like, subscribe, share, join us. Please come back. We appreciate everybody.